Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. So in the previous video, we have learned about the matchers. What is a matchers and why we need to use the matchers in a spec we have seen, right? In this video, we will see some of the matchers that are available. Now, the first matcher what we are going to learn is to be matcher. As we have already worked on this one, to be matcher, if you try to see in our... So we have used this to be matcher. Let's try to learn about this to be matcher. What is this to be matcher? And when we need to use this to be matcher, let's try to see. If I open here, so this is our Jasmine, as you already know, this is the official uh, web page for the Jasmine. And if you go into the docs, in this docs, so right now we are using the version 4.0. So let's click on this 4.0. And here on the left side, you'll be able to see matchers. So you'll be able to see in the navigation matchers uh, link. And if you click on this matchers link, here you will be able to see all the matchers that are available in the jasmine so first matcher what we are going to learn is nothing but to be matcher here so the to be matcher takes the expected as the parameter that is nothing but expected value and if you here if you try to read the definition of this one expect the value the actual value to be triple equal to to the expected value so this is the definition for that one so now here it is trying to see uh, to check the actual value triple equal to with the expected value so this is the thing what the to be matcher will be doing let's try to learn let, let, let's try to explore what is this triple equal to as you people already aware of this one triple equal to if you have seen my course javascript course but still we will explore this one so the parameter is the expected it is of type object the expected value to compare against so here here they have given example also expected of thing dot to be of real thing so that's it now let's try to see so if i open yeah uh, here what is this triple equal to let's try to learn about this triple equal to i will open the inspect element here so let's try to open this inspect element okay i am going to the console so now here if you try to see one double equal to one so now what i am trying to check so one equal to one first i will try to check one equal to one so one is equal to one so that is correct only if you try to see one is equal one is double equal to one that is true so fine now i will try to check one double equal to string of one now what it is trying to say it is trying to say it is true so that means the double equal to if you are checking with only double equal to the number one and also the string with the number one the string of one is one and the same only now let's try to check the same combination with triple equal to so now if you try to see one triple equal to one so i am checking with the number it is written you true so that's fine so that's cut one is equal to one triple equal to one that's correct only now i will try to check one triple equal to string one so if i try to check one triple equal single single one uh, string one it is telling that it is false why it is telling is so here triple equal to not only checks the value it also checks the type of that value for example if you want to check here the type of one it is number it is of type number yeah so one is a number we know it so javascript we have number we don't have integer floats or something like that so everything is a number now here another one the type of one i want to check the type of one so here if you try to see it is a string so that means the triple equal to not only checks the value it also checks the type of so now if the if the value and also the type both matches both are equal only then only triple equal to will return the true or otherwise it will not return the true whereas the double equal to it will check only the value it will not check the type so that is the main difference between the double equal to and triple equal to in the javascript okay hope you understood about this one so now if you try to see that double equal to so here the to be matcher it will check with the triple equal to not with the double equal to so now let's try to implement this to be matcher and let's try to see our let's try to create a spec and let's try to see here this one to be matcher how it will work so here I am writing that to be matcher. Okay. So implementation. So now let's try to see what uh, from what we have learned about this to be matcher. Let's try to implement that one. So now I am writing a new spec. So it should initialize the total. Okay. So now when, when we instantiate the calculator that uh, total should be initialized. So now here let's try to see. Okay, here it will be a function. So in this function, 
create the calculator instance so now i am creating the calculator instance so now when i created a, when i create a calculator instance what it should happen so the total should be initialized to zero so if you try to open if i try to open the calculator.js file here when a calculator is instantiated function calculator the total should be initialized to zero so now let's try to check that one so expect of calculator dot total dot to be of zero right so it should be of type to be zero the two number zero it should be number zero so let's try to see i am running the spec runner already it is running so if i try to refresh it again here you will be able to see should initialize the total so this one got passed now let's try to test this one to be whether it is working correctly or not i will try to match it with the string zero okay if i try to match it with the string zero let's see now the error came so what it is trying to say expected zero to be string zero okay so this is how we will be uh, the to be matcher will be checking so the to be matcher what it will try to do it will try to check with the triple equal to functionality okay so triple equal to functionality now the string zero will never be equal to the number zero the string zero is different and the number zero is the different now for example if i try to say so now we have these these number strings and all those things are primitive data types we already know these are primitive data types the same thing if i try to work on the non primitive data types will it work let's try to see so for example i have a person let person 1 is equal to i am having a person 1 so after name is equal to leela okay i have another person let person 2 is equal to name is equal to leela so if you try to see the person 1 and the person 2 the data is same so whatever the data is same okay so here if you try to see the person 1 is having the name of type leela and person 2 is also having the name leela now i will try to match it the match the expect okay so expect person 1 dot to be person 2 so what will be the output here so now if i try to check the person 1 dot to be person 2 if i try to check this whether is a so everything is equal right so it name name the keys are of same type and leela is also of same same type now if you try to see here we got an error so it is telling that object name leela to be object name leela is not equal so why it is not equal is so whenever you are trying to check there with the triple equal to to be matcher what it will do it will try to check with the triple equal to right now the objects are of reference types these are not primitive data types these are non primitive data types or the reference data types so now it will check the memory location of this person 1 and person 1 and person 2 so the person 1 memory uh, now when a new object is created the person 1 will have a memory location of something like x or something and when person 2 if instead of having the same data also we have created a new object then this will have a memory location of something like y so now we, the memory location x and y are never equal so for that reason so which is showing the error so for example if i try to check person 1 expect person 1 to be of person 1 means it will give you correct only so this is the difference between the primitive data types and the non primitive data types you need to understand this one so right now i will comment out this one so that we will have a reference so when you want to take the the code from the github so you will be have a reference this one so this is about the to be matcher hope you understood about this to be matcher if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you